am so excited to share my next project with you. It is a buffet makeover and let me tell you, this buffet has made a 180 degree transformation. I am so pleased with the outcome and the final project. I'm sharing this video because I am very passionate about recycling and reusing things. If we can recycle it, if we can reuse it, if we can find a, another purpose or give it to someone who can use it, I mean, that is always the way to go. Think twice before you toss something away. If you just think about it, think about me. You don't have to bring it to me, you know, necessarily because I got a lot of stuff that I'm working on right now. But if through watching these videos that you are inspired and your creativity has increased and you are more thoughtful about our environment, then that's why I'm doing this video. So I hope you're inspired and that you enjoy. Thanks. Okay, I'm working on this buffet that was gifted to me. I just want to take the finish off of the top and just have more of a, um, a more natural look on the top. And um, I'm going to paint the rest of the uh, buffet a uh, maybe like a matte black color. So this buffet was pretty dirty when I brought it home and um, it was filled with like spider eggs it smelled a little you know had a musty old smell to it so when I brought it home the first thing I did was really just kind of turn it upside down um, made sure I swept everything you know out underneath and uh, took all the drawers out swept those out good I used a solution of fabric softener and water and I wiped everything down. So right now I'm going to start sanding this. The issue with this buffet is, is that I don't have all the handles. And so nice. I'm going to take the handles off the top ones and I'm going to, you know, fill in here and then I'm going to use something different here. I don't know what it is, but I am going to find um, some other type of knobs to to put on here. So, wish me luck. So, I'm gonna put some stain on here now. I'm gonna try it out and see how how it looks. right now is I'm going to remove some of this hardware not some of it but all the hardware so I can give it a light sanding I'm going to put the screw here so I don't lose any of my pieces I'm already missing enough now the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the door so it's just going to make it, I know it seems like it's a lot of work right now but it really is going to make it easier easier to paint this piece and make sure it's, it's neat or has a neater appearance. Okay, so. since I didn't have enough handles for the buffet, you know, the original handle pieces, I'm going to um, take the top row of drawers and modify that where it just has a knob pull. So what I've we're filled in my holes with some Bondo and I've sanded it down. I've measured the, the distance the equal distance between these two holes that was here so it'll be right in the center this was easiest for me and I did that on all the drawers here so I'm going to drill my holes here and then I'll be ready to paint Yeah, your work clothes. Your work clothes, exactly. This is nice. I mean, do you like it? Yes, I love it. I don't have enough room to, like you say, for my storage. I'm going to put away my pull-out paper, my little thing, my folder thing. Yeah, only for when you need it. Yeah, yeah. It's going to look nice. Enhance the space.